Hi, I'm John Vasco. I'm here at AICHE Spring 2011 meeting uh, with Peter Vikos of uh, Netch Instruments. And Peter's going to tell us a little bit about his company. Peter, can you can you tell us a little bit about Netch? Thank you, John. Niche Instruments is an instrumentation company manufacturing thermal analysis and th thermal, physical thermal physical properties testing instrumentation. We also do contract testing laboratory services for people that want to send samples for the occasional analysis. The area of thermal analysis involves differential scanning calorimetry, known as DSC, thermal gravimetric analysis, which is also known as TGA analysis, as well as a combination of the two, which is called simultaneous thermal analysis. In the areas of thermal physical properties, we get into what's called uh, coefficients of thermal expansion and thermal diffusivity and conductivity. Those are areas that also people are very interested in. At this particular show, we have uh, highlight here our MMC, which is called the multi-module multi calorimeter. That's particularly used uh, in the process safety area where people are interested in knowing the worst case scenario for their products. For instance, if you have a pharmaceutical or a chemical, you want to know at what temperatures will, will a runaway reaction occur. Okay. So in this particular case, we have a module that's uh, called an adiabatic reaction calorimeter, or ARC, as many people know. In this case, what we'll do is you take your sample, which is usually uh, a few grams of sample, which will be placed into this tube vessel. This tube vessel is then placed inside the instrument, and once it's placed inside the instrument, for safety reasons, the instrument is completely closed, the top is closed. This particular module would be sitting inside the instrument. So in this case, it's on the outside of the instrument, which you can have it for safety reasons by tethering it with a cable. Um, you set your analysis to run at a particular temperature range, and you're looking for what's called a worst case scenario or runaway reaction. So, and again, this is called adiabatic reaction calorimetry. So once you gather that information of temperature and pressure versus the energetics, you can take that information and use it in a lot of places as consulting services may use it to decide how should I store my chemicals or what's the worst case scenario I can expect from my chemicals if something bad happens. Unfortunately, there are explosions in plants and we don't want that to happen, so many companies utilize these instruments, the adiabatic reaction calorimeters, to decide what the best parameters are for their safety. Excellent. And how long has uh, Nitch been in, in business? Netch originally started in the late 1800s, but the thermal analysis division of Netch has been around since the early 1950s. Okay, great. And if somebody wanted to find out a little bit more about uh, your company, how would they do that online? They can go to the World Wide Web at netch.com, or they can go directly to our thermal analysis site, which is netch-thermal-analysis.com. Great. Well, thanks so much, Peter. I appreciate it. Thank you, John. Thanks.